With the addition of Evangel to the Kansas Collegiate Athletic Conference, the league now has 12 teams and is moving to a divisional format. This is big in football because it means two automatic bids to the playoffs. Now, that's not to say that the KCAC can't get at-large bids as well, but there will be a minimum of two teams from the conference heading to the 2023 playoffs. It's unique in how the KCAC is doing this, and it's not just in the naming, which, by the way, is also unique. The two divisions will be named for legendary coaches in the league through the years, the Dr. Ted Kessinger Division and the Mr. Gene Bissell Division. Kessinger was a longtime coach at Bethany, 28 years at the helm. He was a Hall of Fame coach. Bissell, a longtime coach as well. He was with Kansas Wesleyan for well into his third decade, and he was a Hall of Fame coach too. The Kessinger Division and the Bissell Division. And the makeup of those two divisions will look like this. Inaugurally, in the Kessinger Division, it will be Bethany, of course, Bethel, Evangel, Friends, McPherson, and Southwestern. In the Bissell Division, it will be Avila, Kansas Wesleyan, of course, Ottawa, Sterling, Tabor, and St. Mary. A big part of what makes this unique, though, is the fact that the two divisions will not remain the same after 23 and 24. There will be divisional realignment. I know we've been talking about conference realignment in college football for a number of years, but the KCAC is bringing about divisional realignment, and that is because the league doesn't want it to be top-heavy for one division bottom heavy maybe for another division, just a, a competitive imbalance there. And so every two years, the leagues will be realigned. Now, the alignment of the divisions right now comes from the win totals in conference play through 2020 and 2021. In two years, they will be realigned. So 2025's Kessinger and Bissell divisions will be made up from the win totals of 2022 and 2023 in football play. It's a, a snaking process going from one division to the other and back and forth again. You can look it all up on the website, kcacsports.com. So unique realignment in college football, divisional realignment, but new divisions. That's the big thing in the KCAC. The two automatic playoff bids coming from the two divisions, 12 teams in the KCAC this season. Thanks for watching Midwest Sportsnet. We enjoy talking about small college sports and more throughout the Midwest and beyond. God bless you. Have a great day.